G'day everyone and welcome back to NS2HD. This is round four of a four round matchup between Team 156 and Skullcrush. And I'm going to bring this whole match to you. If you haven't seen the first three rounds, stop watching this immediately for two reasons. One, I have an Australian accent. And the second is, you need to watch the first rounds before you can see this. So, uh, spoilers from now, it is two to Skullcrush and one to Team 156. So, 156 playing for the draw here and Skull Crush playing for the We Crush the Other Team trophy. Now, what have we got? We have a Flight Control Command Station and an Atrium Hive. So, 156 fighting out from those windows and Atrium being the home of Skull Crush and they are already Skull Crushing. Four Skulks coming in. They're waiting at the vents. Oh, their teamwork is so tight. Squidget doesn't know what's about to hit him, but he does get his spots Wombat. But, um... Come on, Wombat! Nope, he goes down to Death Industry. And then Cola tries to take down Death Industry and does so. Meanwhile, two fast extractor drops. So, we've got uh, 156 going for a lot of res very early on and I don't think they're going to be able to hold that many extractors that fast but it would be awesome if they could that one not built, uh, sorry not powered yet that one's powered and running two harvesters from uh, Skulk Rush and that drifter is just sitting there in data core, he's just dropped it, yep probably waiting for the infestation spread Wombat goes down to squidge its rifle, but always good to see those kills. Oh, Epitome just got parasited. Oh, wow. That was fantastic. Always great to get that on tape. Two Marines chilling in Dartico. Oh, they've killed off that Harvester. That is good. One Skulk there. He's not going to be able to deal with those two Marines. And we've got mine drops, so we're going to see some new mines. Corey has been working on the new mine, been checking out the uh, new mine 3D model in the office. That's pretty cool. He's texturing that up. Hopefully do a preview of that on uh, youtube.com slash unknown worlds, maybe this week, maybe next. So these cysts are all dying, so that's a bit of a blow to Skull Crush. Not a lot of combat happening at the moment. We've got something going on in sub-access. Let's head up there and check that out. Yeah, that extractor's dead, or has been destroyed, more correctly, and this extractor's in trouble too, we've got three skulks in here. What? And what? Oh, what? My head is full of awesomeness. Oh, that is amazing. I've always wanted to see this in a competitive game. Hello, Ark. Yes. Yes, he's coming for you, Lurky. I did not believe it. 156 is arc rushing. I have been wanting to see this in a competitive game forever. 156 is making my dreams come true. If this works, I will probably squeal like a little girl. It's getting in range. No way. This is insane. It is loading up. It's 97%. It is going to fire at this hive. Here it goes. And it's already down to 60%. It's charging up for its first shot. Any second now. Why is it not firing? Oh no! And all the skulls just killed it! <laughs> no way did that just happen. Uh, no way! Okay, there is a second hive, but what a play by 156. 156 deserves a trophy for that play. That is exceptional. And now if they can find this second hive very quickly, they will win this game because they'll be able to kill off those aliens and they will not be able to spawn again. But they're going to have to find it very fast. And I can't see where they are because we've got the shade minimap bug happening. But, um... <laughs> Death Industry doing the funny mine dropping. Ooh, interesting placement of a mine there. And they've got to find this hive. 
They are no doubt poking into every tech point room. It cannot be catalyzed. That's an important point, so it's going to take a while for it to tick up to 50%. There are mines being dropped everywhere, and they found the hive. Here we go. So now it's up to the remaining aliens. There are five aliens alive, but they're going to have to defend for a very long time. And yep, it's going down. What? What just happened? Oh, all the aliens were killed before the hive went down. What an exceptional play from Team 156. That was amazing. And that is it for this round of four. And that is a, uh, a tie. Two games to two. And exceptional play from both teams. Very impressive. And I'm going to go back and watch that, that arc rush over and over again. That was just exceptional. And my congratulations to 156 for having the balls to go with it. So thanks a lot for watching, everyone. And as usual, leave your feedback on the channel and I'll see you all soon for more NS2HD videos. Big thank you to 156 and Skullcrush for having me here today.